still arriving a few minutes before the cup actually starts. The bookies know him's rising fast and master proven pretty well by now. There goes the top weight rising fast with jockey Per Tell hoping to gather in his third Melbourne Cup. You know it's flung a half gale as they parade the new market straight on the way to the starting barrier. This is Ken Howard, privileged to bring you the broadcast of the great race. Front from Gay Helios, Fiafolio and rising fast. Pandy Star is first to weaken, and at the distance, Gay Helios is clear, but Pertel switches the New Zealander, rising fast to the outside of Gay Helios, and races past him and almost a stride. Now rising fast comes away from Gay Helios, with Hellion finishing two to their one, wide out in the centre. Rising fast doing better than Hellion and Gay Helios, and rising fast going on strongly wins the Melbourne Cup. There's a roar of applause for Rising Fast and jockey Jack Pertell as the winner returns to scale. The great New Zealander is only the fourth horse in history to win the Caulfield and Melbourne Cup double. After this great win, Rising Fast is being called one of the greatest horses ever. <laughs>